morning everybody. We're uh, coming into Oyster Creek here for a uh, two vehicle accident called by the local police department to come assist and I'm not sure exactly which unit we're coming for. I think it's a, a car and a truck. Um, they said unit two needed a flatbed. They did not advise which one it was that we were coming for. Um, we'll have to figure that out when we get there. But uh, a firefighter buddy of mine that's on scene uh, said it was, they're pretty banged up. I think the car got rear end damage and the truck has front end damage. So we'll be pulling up. It should be just right here around this corner. Uh, Got when we get there, so just should be right here, right around this corner here. They said it was in front of Domino's, which is just right up the road here. Yep, there they are. It's like I was just pulled on scene there. Get in the car. Here, I'm moving my unit for you. Okay. I just, I'll grab it from the rear just okay, like that. Cool. That way ain't nobody got to move nothing. Good. I appreciate it. Yes, sir. That room's a lot better. There's uh, bags and my shovel in there too if y'all need it. Loving it. It's a lot better than them internationals. Yeah, they're dogs. Well, I saw like, the I saw the wrap on it. I was no, like, I didn't have time to wrap it anyways. <laughs> well, I just realized I fist bumped the wrong hand.
You can use it. There should be bags and stuff in there too if y'all need them. Put it in that way, you gotta. It's really easy if you put it upside down, you can kind of smash it down. And then it'll. Okay, ambulance. None of the lights wanted to work on it. Oh no. Like interior <laughs> lights, nothing. Nothing. He pulled up on scene, he's like, well, I guess they're gonna have a dark ride. Look, I can't see nothing. They got that multi flex system in there and they're. Oh no. What's that? Yeah, that's good. We was gonna need it anyways. I didn't want to walk all the way down to our truck. <laughs> yeah, it's, the, it's down there. Away. That's the track, huh? Yeah, we gotta do this and then get to the track. Pull forward or give me that pull forward, we'll get this right here. Freeport yard okay. there. Uh, there's an inventory or anything I need to sign for you? Or? No, no, because it's, it's kind of pointless because I don't have them here to log it. For long. Right. All right, we're gonna pull forward so we can get the rest of this little bit of stuff cleaned up here. We don't worry about it. Okay. What about? We need any oil dry for that spot there. I got some, man. It's on it. All the way there. Let me grab it. Oh, solid. Yep. Out. And it's biodegradable. Right there in the front of the box, right there in front of all the recovery gear. I gotta refill it anyway. Yeah, now. Right. On this side, Just real quick while we're still here, so I don't have to stop anywhere else. Running on a little bit of a time crunch this morning. I have a event that I'm working this weekend. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to be able to film it because of the rules of the uh, property. So 
I'm trying to get there. So. Alright. Y'all good with us, I guess? You out here? Yeah. You good? You good with me? Alright. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, sir. No problem. Y'all have a good one. Yes, sir. And we will get this thing off here. I don't know if uh, I didn't check at the scene to see if they left the keys with it. Mostly because it didn't really matter. It wasn't. This thing's not really gonna roll too easy. Anyways. Just because how heavy damage it's got here. Take these new ratchets. Like this one here, I don't know if you can see, but the whole body and everything is rubbing the tire there. Frame and everything's bent and twisted that tire doesn't roll the other side I think rolls just that one side with the heavy damage that doesn't kind of ratchet I've had bad experience with them wanting to stick even if you lube them up I don't know if you deal with those they are but get the chain off the front there if I get it lower down I'll see if it has keys so I can roll that window up Maybe shift lock it if it'll shift lock just to maybe come off just a little bit easier. If I have to uh, lube up the bed and it'll slide right off. busy 
start to the morning. Just kind of hoping I would have a little bit of extra time to get ready for the event that I'm going to be working. But that wasn't so. Do not see a set of keys. Oh, there, 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 actually. I'm gonna make it slightly easier. And I can roll up their windows so I can secure the vehicle as best I can. So it doesn't really. matter too much just because this one corner here is dragging it's only gonna roll off so far anyways about that far Let's see if maybe I can put a little bit of angle in the bed and see if maybe that'll help it a little bit Fight me a little bit. Make sure I'm not going too far. That would be about good. Let me go ahead and snug that up there. Uh, that door probably ain't gonna open. Looks like it's pinched pretty good. Go ahead and throw this thing back in park. from underneath it. Looking how well you can see, but the truck's walking forward there. The bed is staying stationary. Push my bed back underneath it there a little bit so I can get my hooks off a little, a little easier. I really want to stick my hands under it. That's where I free spooled it from. Walk one more time. Just so I don't have to pull the bed out at such a steep angle. Set her on the ground nice and easy. That is that. Oops. Back on there. And take our free spool off. We're gonna finish up my paperwork here. 
Um, I think both occupants of the vehicle were injured and they were transported. I don't know how bad or anything, but if you would, keep them in your prayers and send them well wishes. And uh, go ahead and finish up what I got here. And appreciate y'all watching. If y'all would, please subscribe, like, and share.